Now from Place Ministries, another inspirational moment. Welcome back to your place. Matthew 26, 75 says, Then Peter remembered the word Jesus had spoken before the rooster crows, you would disown me three times. And he went outside and wept bitterly. When you get to heaven and you ask Peter, what was one of the greatest experiences in his life? Do not be surprised if he doesn't take you back to Matthew 26 and tell you it was the night before Jesus was crucified when he disowned Jesus three times around a campfire. Then if you ask Peter, what gave him the courage to be crucified, as tradition says, upside down, because he didn't consider himself worthy to be crucified the way our Lord was crucified. Again, don't be surprised if he doesn't take you back to a campfire the night before Jesus was crucified and he failed by denying him three times. A week and a half ago, Russell Wilson, the quarterback for the Seattle Seahawks, was on his way to his second straight Super Bowl win in just three years in the NFL when he threw an interception at the end of the game from the two yard line about to score in the final seconds of the game to give his team the win. After the game, I want you to listen to a few comments by Russell Wilson. He said, we have great character, guys that love the game of football, guys that love each other. I'm grateful for everybody. I'm grateful for the Seahawks. I'm grateful for the situation. He went on to say, disappointing, but I believe that we'll be back. And talking about his legacy off the field, he said, I want to be a Christian man that helps lead and change lives and help serve other people. He went on to say, it's not about me, it's not about me. It's about helping other people. And that's where I keep my focus more than anything. In living out your place in life and ministry, learn from one of the great heroes of the faith, Peter, and learn from a modern day sports hero, Russell Wilson, that life doesn't come without defeat, failure, along the journey. Your Place is a weekday devotional from Place Ministries. Our focus is helping followers of Christ know how and why God created them and be encouraged to do what God created them to do in life and ministry. For a list of free resources, go to placeministries.org and join us every weekday right here at Your Place.